In this series of videos, I'm examining stereotypes of female scientists that appear in the movies. According to research into this topic, there are six basic stereotypes. The male woman scientist is the first stereotype we'll consider. This character typically lacks feminine charms and often exhibits male behavior, or rather behavior that filmmakers use to show that she is just one of the boys. She is often assertive, curses freely, and drinks or smokes heavily. Alternatively, her behavior can be similar to how male scientists are characterized in film, that is intelligent but obsessed with their work. An example of the male woman scientist is microbiologist Dr. Ruth Levitt, played by Kate Reed in The Andromeda Strain. She is part of a select team of scientists racing to figure out what's killed almost all of the inhabitants of a small town. This particular character is an older woman lacking in feminine charms, which fits the male woman type, and she has a hidden weakness. Levitt has undiagnosed epilepsy, which causes her to initially miss the fact that the science team is dealing with an alien species. As she is scanning multiple images for evidence of microbial growth, the repetitive flashing of the scanner triggers a mild epileptic seizure, causing her to blank out when the sample with the alien organism undergoes rapid expansion. This weakness almost dooms humankind. Another example of the male woman scientist is Dr. Grace Augustine, played by Sigourney Weaver in the movie Avatar. Augustine is gruff, tough, and aggressive in protecting her research territory. In addition to supposedly masculine characteristics such as cursing and a combative nature, Augustine is obsessed with her science. In what must be one of the funniest cinematic depictions of scientific single-mindedness, Augustine, mortally wounded and being carried into an unexplored region of Pandora expresses what any dedicated scientist might say in a similar situation. To summarize, the male woman stereotype perpetuates the myth that being a scientist is incompatible with being feminine and attractive to men. However, she can be emotional in her pursuit of science and is often one of the more interesting scientist characters in a film. In the next video in this series, we'll consider the old maid stereotype. For more information on the research behind female stereotypes in the cinema, please see the references I've included at the end of this video.